Hey, man, well, okay, let, let's come back to that, but let, let's let's close out WWF. How, why did you leave the WWF? Uh, we were in France, uh, Ray and I, and they were putting us in single matches. So I went up to Pat Patterson. I said, hey, Pat, I said, what's going on, man? I said, you're splitting Ray and me up. Like, you know, you're beating my big man out there, and you beat my big man. We're no good anymore. So uh, he goes, oh, no, don't worry about it. Don't worry. I said, well, I am worried about it, Pat. I said, because, you know, I mean, what the hell? Why are we doing singles? Well, you know, we're just, we're going to do some stuff. You know, don't worry, though. You're going to, we're going to take care of you. I said, well, take care of me. I said, well, what about Ray? Well, he'll be okay. I said, he'll be okay. Okay doesn't work for me. I said, you know, you're splitting us up. This is bullshit. I said, you know what, Pat? I'm done. And he goes, what? I said, I'm done. I had enough of this. So he goes, no, 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 listen, listen, you know, you're going to be going home tomorrow. I'll think about it. I said, no, think about it. I'm tell you right now, I'm done. <laughs> so I walk. So I go into Vince's office after I get back to the States. I sit down with him. I tell him. He got all heated. You know, I told him, I said, you know, I said, I, I gave my, my balls to you, man. I said, nobody worked as hard as I worked with the injuries that I had. I said, now you got guys that get a hangnail. They're out for a week. And then Vince started screaming, you know, I took care of you. I said, you took care of me. I said, I could have lost my arm in that WrestleMania. And I still went out there because you begged me to go out there because we were wrestling against Demolition. I said, Ray had a torn groin. He retore it the night before. He could hardly move. I said, my elbow, they told me in the hospital I could lose it if I land on it. Yet I still went out there for you. You took care of me. You do shit for me. So he swelled up, you know, then started swelling up. And I said, you better sit your ass down. I ain't fucking playing with you. And he was at the under end of the table. I said, I'm done. I said, so have a good life, basically, you know, on my way. Walked out the door, never looked back. That was it. Goddamn. Um, what was the deal with your arm? What was the arm injury? I messed up my, my elbow. So I went to the hospital and they said, listen, if you land on this elbow, there's a good chance you could lose your arm. And I was like, okay. So I went back, obviously my arm in a sling that they put it in. And Vince was in a meeting and, and they called him out of it. And he saw me in the sling and he's like, you know, what the hell is this? And I said, I got to talk to you, man. And I told him what they told me. And he's, he was like, please, Paul, please, I need you in this match. You know, that's why they cut the demolition match down to like one minute. Because we were both a mess. And then they're like, you know, can you take that off the, off his shoulders? And I'm like, holy shit. You know, I'm like, yeah, I guess. So I went out and bought a, um, a uh, roller blade or a, a skater's elbow pad. Uh, we padded it all up, put it on my arm, took the bump, tried to land a little, you know, cockeyed. So I won't land on the arm. And then when I got back to the locker room, they had a doctor waiting and he took 30 cc's of fluid out of my elbow. He says, I don't take 30 cc's out of a knee. And I took 30 cc's out of your elbow. And I was like, well, we made it through, man, you know? So that was it.